hi beauties I have no idea how I'm looking how I'm framed I know I look crazy but it's exactly one not exactly but you know it's around about one month um, since I told you guys what was happening with my hair and stuff and I couldn't decide if to do these updates like monthly or like quarterly or I don't know but people seem to be having results really fast like within two weeks and a month and all of that so I was like all right maybe I should try a one month and see what happens but anyway so I just did my henna gloss so I don't have on any makeup I'm still wearing a little rough shirt that got uh, you probably can see the henna all over my shoulders make sure you cover your clothes if you're gonna do henna because it gets everywhere um, and yeah wear gloves cuz usually I wear gloves so I wouldn't have had to talk about this but today I only had one glove where I was doing my hair so I put one glove on and I thought I'd be fine but yeah is there a difference is there's a difference where I'm looking but anyways so yeah the hair is still wet and Obviously, you can still see, like, I have my, what did I do? I did the henna gloss, no, I washed my hair. I did the henna gloss, which I made with um, a deep conditioner. So, I didn't dip deep condition this time, but I was still feeling a little bit dry. So, what I did is, when I put my leave-in conditioner, just the Shea Moisture stuff that you buy over the counter, and I used castor oil, regular oil, castor oil, the clear one, because that's what I had to hand. And I put that on my hair and then I just put like a supermarket bag like like this on my hair and I sat under the dryer for another 10 minutes so that the leave-in and the oils and stuff could still penetrate I have remember I talked about <laughs> remember how I talked about henna like straightening not straightening loosening the curl pattern of some naturals what about henna loosening the curl pattern and some curls because it loosens my curl pattern but not all of them you can see that my hair still is very tightly coiled like right here I mean it's nothing happening there it's just all coiled up everything the peas are still there the kitchen and whatever but then look at this look at this madness what happened to him he's been there for the last month just straight you see that it's been taken let me I took a picture so cuz I I can't figure out what's going on with that guy so some of the curls are like looser like this but this thing is just straight in the air but anyways with the loosening my hair feels softer so <laughs> I feel happy um, yeah but I don't know how to, how do you do a length check on a teeny mini afro I don't even understand is that longer than the last time I don't know I probably should have watched the previous video to see what it was looking like before I feel like right in here which is historically my thickest area of hair like most dense and also most coarse I feel like I've had growth in here, but I don't know how to measure it. Like, do I get a ruler? I have a ruler. All right, centimeters it is. So that's my scalp. So seven centimeters. Is that what that says? Seven there. What is this? This one. Oh, like it want to say six. Oh, I pull out here. This one is six and a half. I don't know. I feel like in here grew some. That one says seven two. This is probably not a very reliable way of doing it, but I don't know how else to do it. Seven. So that whole area is seven. In here is six. Most everywhere else is six, it seems. 
I wanted to see if I could. Ah. Oh, this is my favorite thing, y'all. This is a leggings that I cut a tight. You know, when your tight's too small. So, last time I was telling you guys about my patches, but I couldn't really see them that well to tell you when my hair is in the band but i know where they are when my hair is loose so this is a patch right here that i'm trying to work on with ayurveda supposedly it works with um with balding and alopecias um that's another one they are a lot all in and through my head there's another one. But anyways, I just wanted you guys to see. To see what I was talking about. But yeah, I love the, this thing here. Just take it. Tie it around my hair. And it doesn't pull. Like, y'all with 4C hair, you know, man. When, when anything catch on your hair, man, it just... Jeez. Tight, like it just coils around it, and then you try to take it out, it just rip it out. Yeah, I can't deal with that. Anyways, I'm working on editing some videos for you guys, so I thought I would pop in with this one month update. It might be too soon, I might just do another one in two months instead of one month, and then go quarterly from there. In as much as I can, my hair still falls out. You probably saw that falling and I'm literally just passing my hand I don't know if it's the anemia anemia I don't know I'm a zinc deficient I don't know but I'm working on it so yeah that's it see you next time guys oh and look out I'm gonna put I'm gonna put something here but I'm gonna put my most recent upload down at the bottom that way you can see when I um show you guys this girl that I just got done making okay um, so subscribe turn on your notifications if you like hair updates press the like button um, if you just like me press the like button subscribe and sharing I think is caring yes I think YouTube thinks so too so the more likes, YouTube knows you like it, you like me, you like what I'm doing, and they will start to put me out there, okay? So, take care of your girl. Alright guys, later. Bye!